This was the op-ed in, in the New York Times last Thursday. Uh, the title of it, Sheldon Adelson, Warren Buffett, and Bill Gates on Immigration Reform. Well, what did we see in the newspaper today? News from Microsoft. Was it that they are having to raise wages to try to get enough good quality engineers uh, to do the work? Are they expanding? Are they hiring? No, that's not what the news was, unfortunately. Not that at all. This is the headline in Microsoft in the today. Um, Microsoft to cut up to 18,000 jobs next year. Microsoft confirmed it will cut up to 18,000 jobs over the next year. Part of the tech titan's effort to streamline its business under new uh, CEO. That is a significant thing. Uh, indeed, Microsoft employs about 125,000 people. They're laying off 18,000. And the company laid off 5,000 in 2009. Yet their founder and former uh, leader, Mr. Gates, says we've got to have more and more people into our country um, to take those kind of jobs. It's pretty interesting, really, and we need to be thinking about what it all means and asking ourselves, what is the situation today for American graduates of STEM degrees and technology degrees? Uh, do we have enough and do we need to have people come to our country to take those jobs? Or indeed, do we not have a shortage of workers and do we have uh, um, and, uh, difficulty of people finding jobs?